Everybody knows her. Everybody loves yes. her. Ali Wong. Ali Wong. The last time I saw her, we did Ponchos. In, oh, uh, Ponchos. Manhattan Beach. Yeah, no she kidding. came down to run, run a set. And she was great. It was just sort of like, I think um, a lot of being a star is not only having a talent, but having the uh, disposition, the belief, and not belief that like, oh, I'm better than anyone, but just a belief that you deserve it and, and just live in it. Because I think it's, it's a lot for some people, you know, and I think she, maybe because she already has a family, um, she seems to be handling it well. And when she came down there, she was like, you know, I, I need to try these jokes and struck a nice balance between making them laugh, but also doing what she came to do in terms of her new jokes, mm. which a lot of comics will bail. And, you know, especially if they see other comics doing well, they'll bail and do jokes that are, they know work. Where some sometimes you came to do your newer stuff, or at least mix it up, one for you, one for me, kind of thing. Yeah, we go back to ego. You know, uh, there's a, there's a lot of ego in the world of stand up comedy because it's such an individual sport where you just want to you want to like you're on a lineup with other people. It's like a home run derby. How many how many dingers did you hit? Oh, 15. Right, I gotta be 15, right, and right, then you get exactly. up there and you take your at bats. Whereas maybe you don't feel like you know winning the home run derby that maybe you came to do something else that day. 